Thank you for tuning in to another Debaco University video. In this video, we'll be looking at different classifications of cannabis and how we kind of define some of those classifications as well. So first off, it's all cannabis, say in the hemp, sense that hemp, fiber, marijuana, all fall under the broad category of cannabis. Within the cannabis category, though, each offer further classification and has specific definition, allowing for distinction from the different subsets within the broader term that we call cannabis. So we have hemp being defined by the FDA and Farm Bill, particularly the 2018 Farm Bill that was signed into law on December 20th, 2018. Among other things, this new law changes certain federal authorities relating to the production and marketing of hemp. They define hemp as the plant cannabis sativa ale and any part of that plant, including the seeds thereof, and all derivatives, extracts, cannabinoids, isomers, acids, salts, and salts of isomers, whether growing or not, with a delta-9 tetracannabidiol concentration of not more than 0.3% of a dry weight basis. And that is THC, if you were one of delta-9 THC that you may be familiar with. This is how they define hemp. Hemp is basically not more than 0.3% dry weight. THC is how the FDA and Farm Bill of 2018 define hemp. Now we have also fiber hemp. So within hemp, there's kind of all these different kind of uh, subsets, but fiber hemp is a sustainable and high yielding industrial crop that can help meet high de global, global demands for fiber. So it's been used in the sense as the actual kind of twine here, or fiber production for clothing, for example, as well. Hemp can be grown for fiber, seeds, and or for du dual purpose in a wide range of geographic zones and climates, making it favorable to grow in different areas. So it's not just like it's got to be isolated to one area. It is favorable over a large range of geographic zones. And also the products that it can produce can also be used for a wide variety of different uh, tasks or different kind of uh, textiles, foods, cosmetics, medicines, antimicrobials. There's a whole bunch of things kind of looking at a potential for the use of fiber hemp. And then marijuana, lastly here, how we how do we define marijuana then? Uh, with, this can be called weed, pot, dope, or cannabis, just in the kind of quick term. And this is usually referring to the dried flowers and leaves of the cannabis plant. And this contains some mind-altering uh, psychoactive compounds like uh, THC, for example. And this is, as well as other active compounds, it can also contain cannabidiol, which is CBD, and they are non-mind altering. But what, again, defines it as truly marijuana goes back to the 2018 Farm Bill. And marijuana would be defined as simply having greater than 0.3% uh, THC on a dry weight basis. So immediately, as soon as that plant, as soon as that flower goes above that threshold there, it crosses the divide between what we define here as hemp to what we come and refer to here as marijuana. So again, important to make that distinct, distinction, and hopefully you're able to learn something within this video here. 